boss rap. I got four cars and they all black. Got four bras and they all that. We call that ballin'. Doing this is my calling. Flow is so appalling. My phone off and she calling. I'm like, yeah, what it do? Penthouse man, what is going on, everybody? Welcome back today, guys, to the channel. Back here, Gran Turismo Sport for yet another episode, man. Today's a big one. If you guys don't know or are living underneath a rock, uh, version 1.15 has finally dropped. It included 13 cars. We're going to be taking a look at one of those for today. And if you guys don't know already, it's going to be the E30, man. We had to pick up the E30, and uh, we're going to be running some laps here on Scuba. It was the uh, brand new track that just got dropped in. It's been a long time coming. We had this back on Forza Motorsport 4, and that's where I initially fell in love with this track. Now, the only thing, though, is that it doesn't give us the short section. It's only the long section, which is a little bit disappointing because back in Forza 4 days, I mean, that's all that I really ran was the short section. So I know Gran Turismo is completely different, and I know a lot of the people here always run the long section. It's a very weird, interesting, uh, you know, kind of thing where the one console is running the one version and then the other console... It, I don't know, man. Other than that, though, we had an Aston Martin come in. We had some beautiful Red Bull cars coming in. We had an FC, an R33 to drop. We had a 2017 GTR. Lots of things, man. Lots of things. So little time, though, man. Lewis Hamilton referenced lot number one, Nuremberg Ring. What the hell is that? I don't... Go to Lewis Hamilton's channel. Okay. We also had the VR get an update finally, which was nice to see, and they dropped in a time trials, uh, some sort of mode on there. So obviously, there's still lots of work to be done on the VR mode itself, but at least they're updating it. They're not forgetting about it, and hopefully, we'll see you know actual races coming into the games. If you guys don't know, you can't really do much on the VR mode except for just kind of look around, and that's really about it. Now we do have our E30 already purchased, 234 horsepower bed. It's not a lot, but it should be just enough to get us around the track in style, mind you. But I'm excited to hear this thing start up. Ladies and gentlemen, let me know what you're sipping on down below. I got a nice fresh cup, large regular coffee on deck from Tim Hortons, man. Triple cup today, man. Triple cup. Forget the doubles. I got one, two, and then the third cup, man. Look, I, it's stupid. I know. Okay. Really? That's all that you're going to give me? Oh my god, that's terrible. Alright, now we do have the full wheel set up for today, man. CSL Elite here. We have the pedals, the handbrake, the shifter from Fnatic. So huge thank you to them. All of their links will be found down below if you're looking to pick up your own setup. But uh, here we go though, man. Rocking that M3 life. Just want to quickly get a little look around. I don't think it's going to be possible just because of the fact that we are on the wheel. I wish it was a little bit more versatility when you're on the wheel, you know, being able to look around a little bit. Uh, oh, I guess you go. Oh. I mean, let me just go ahead and eat my words then. Can I do that outside the car, though? That, that I can't do. See, that's, that's my problem. I mean, we can look back, but we can't really do too much, though. Let's just quickly, uh, maybe drop a gear, yank the handbrake, and let's get these tires a little warm, man. Here we go. Let's try it. Remember, 234 horsepower. Sounds good. I don't know if you guys own an E30 at all. If you do, man, let me know in the comment section. Would love to see one on Twitter, though. That'd be sick. Third person camera, once again, not a fan of it at all, man. Oh, yeah, wrong button, sorry. My favorite view, though, man, the hood view. I know some of you guys may not like it. I personally love this view myself. I don't know. I've always been a fan of it on the Gran Turismo series. I feel like if you don't like the hood view, you don't like Gran Turismo. That's all I'm saying right now. Oh, oh. Told you, man, this thing's gonna be fun. It's gonna be a lot of fun, actually. We're gonna get some hot laps in, and then maybe we will try to get this thing sideways continuously. But it already seems like it's gonna be a tough ride. It really does. We're gonna try to throw on some horsepower a little bit, maybe a tire change as well We're on Sport Hards. She wants to get out there, but she wants to get the grip at the same time. The comforts should allow us to get, you know, a consistent. Oh damn! My foot just slipped right off the pedal right there. <laughs> Consistent throw on these corners, but we'll see though. Look at that. Not bad though. We're on 720 degrees of rotation. If you guys are wondering, force feedback's at 100. And I think in game, I have the settings set to, I think, 2 and 1 on the wheel settings. If you guys are uh, playing Gran Turismo, you know what that means. If not, well, don't worry about it. We are on the edge of this thing, man. I've seen that thing about to give. Okay, okay. That was fun. I do believe that Fnatic updated the wheel, actually, from the last time that we were here. 
So that's something to uh, check out for the patch notes, maybe from Fnatic. Oh, there we go. I'm going to definitely look at that and see what has been changed. I think the purple mode on the wheel now is just a little bit more consistent, feels a lot stronger, and uh, it's now compatible, exactly compatible with Gran Turismo, which is awesome. Come on, baby. Oh, there we go. Obviously, you can tell the car needs some work. The differential, not exactly locking, but it does feel good. We're just kind of straightening right out because of the fact that that damn inside tire is just uh, slowly bringing us to a stop. I'm going to throw this in. Yeah, I don't think so. Damn, what do I think I do? Can't really see any of my gauges. <laughs> They're blacked out, man. What the hell? Maybe we need a little bit of light in here. Just gonna just take this in nice and smooth. See, it wants to kind of rotate, but if we just can hold it, right, 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 there we go. Jesus, man. This thing's sloppy though. I wasn't expecting it to be so sloppy. So, the plan right now is I want to go ahead and take this online. I want to make sure I'm confident though. So, I'm gonna go ahead, throw on some horsepower on here, do a quick little tune, and then see if it's ready to uh, hop online. Because obviously, I don't want to get online and look like an idiot. So we're just going to try to uh, do the best we can here, tune it up, throw on some mileage points at it, and see what happens. I think next episode I'd like to take a look at that R33 maybe, or that FC to be honest with you, because that FC looks nice. I'd like to see everybody at Scuba with the R33, all the damn JDM icons would be sick to see that, that'd be really cool. Alright, look at it man, <laughs> tell me you just seen that man shift. You look so uncomfortable in there. You'll be okay, buddy. Don't worry. Looks good, though, man. The E30. Classic. If, if I could own one, obviously, I think that would be on the top of my list. But, I mean, for you know, a good E30 clean M3, it's a lot of money right now, man. It definitely is. Can't just throw a you know a 5K stack at it and say, I want an E30. I mean, you could, but I mean, right? it just wouldn't be as nice. That was the biggest thing was just learning the brakes on here. They're very, very touchy. So I'd be stabbing the brakes and uh, the front tires would be locking up on me. But, I mean, we got the hang of it after a little bit. Car feels really good. It is a very, very nimble car as long as you can, you know, be in the right gear for the corner. Uh, it really does hold. The suspension did a great job at least countering what I was doing to it. Oh, yeah. A little bit of sideways, baby. That was fun, though. We're going to go over to the drift setting, right? I know a lot of you guys yell at me when I don't do the damn drift setting. Uh, we're going to go ahead and bring that up to 340. Ooh, ooh, hello, babe. We still have 900 and, uh, oh, that is the max, actually. Nope, it's not. 394, we're doing it. Boom, man, big boy status. Here we go. 604 mileage points left. Not really too happy about that, to be honest, but that's okay. Uh, comfort, we're going to go hard, man, just because I know everybody else is going to run hard. So I want to try to get this tune dialed in for that. Uh, ride height, let's bring this down. I'm going to go 449. I'm going to show you guys the tune today because I know a lot of you guys like to see the tunes. And uh, sometimes you guys like to, you know, make fun of my tunes, man. Go ahead, man. Take the shots, man. I don't care. I'm just kidding, man. I do, all right? Don't be making fun of my tunes, please. Help me, man. Don't laugh at me. I did like the front end. We're going to just stiffen it just a little bit here. And we're going to also stiffen that rear end, which will make it easier to oversteer. End quotations in the side right there. Uh, dampening. I don't want to touch anything on the dampening because I think the suspension was perfect. Negative camber, though, on the rear. Jesus, man. We got quite a bit here. But I did like that, though. We're going to go, actually, negative 2.7. Let's go 1.9. Toe. Let's bring that toe back in. All right. Now we're going to need a little bit of help on the differential. And we're going to need some uh, fully customized gears. Looks like we already have. Okay. All right. Diff here. Let's get it. Go 50-50 on the diff. I think that'll be perfect, especially for GT. And then transmission. Let's go fully customizable. Let's bring that out just a slight bit. 155 top speed. Final gears. I think we got ourselves a drift car, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, I could be wrong. I've been wrong before. But 400 horsepower, man. Here we go. That's going to be quite a bit. Oh, but. But. A little bit of throttle control. Don't you dare... Come back. Come back. 
ho, 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 hello, man, let's get it. This thing is going to slide like there's no tomorrow, man. Here we go. A little bit of handbrake. Oh, yeah. God damn, comfort hearts, man. I'm back on ice. How's everybody doing? Because I'm cold right now, man. Look at this. Like, full lock, corner to corner. It's crazy what a little bit of horsepower and a change of tires will do for you. Yep. Let's try that. Ah, uh, too much, too much, too much. Right, let's see what we got. We're going to just do a full send down here. And then, we're going to take it online and see what we do. Look at this thing, man. We are about to beat the shit out of this third gear. Oh, boy. Let's get back in the throttle before it's too late. I got it. I got it. Don't let go. <laughs> Grass line. Come on. We were sideways that whole time. I tapped the wall. I tapped the wall. Oh, shit. All right. <laughs> I'm getting out of here, man. Oh, hell no. There you go. Look at it. Oh, my God, man. That was full on Tokyo Drone. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, never mind. It's not that crazy, but, man. We get some angle, though, man. Oh, get it, man. Look at how twitchy it is. I love it. <laughs> Understeer is huge. Oh, full send right into the grass. There you go. Oh, it doesn't get any better than that. Not bad. Not bad, right, man? Round of applause, please. Thank you so much. I guarantee, man, there's going to be a ton of lobbies with Scuba. Look at that. Here's 6 of 16, 8 out of 10. Just cruise, my dudes, eh? I mean, what if I want to drift? Want to drift, man? Chill. Why is everyone just chilling and drift and just cruising? JDM Battle. Ooh, that'd be fun, actually. Um, what else we got here? Not as many as I thought there would have been. Oh, here we go. No. Nope. Track day. Where's the drift day? Drift tune tandems. Right there, man. That's exactly what I need. Here we go. And he's from Canada. It couldn't have got any easier right there. That's perfect. So far, though, I got to give this car two thumbs up. Looks good. Sounds good. I mean, it's a BMW M3 E30. I mean, really, though, it's iconic. How could you say no to this car? It is $200,000 in game, though. So it is a little bit of a high price tag, right? But. All right. We're going to give this a shot. First time online in scuba. How do I think it's going to go? I mean,. I don't know, man. I mean, hopefully good, right? I mean, that is the plan. It's gonna be, uh, it's gonna take a little bit to get used to this. And by a little bit, I mean right away. Because I got this shit. Wait, are they drift on it? Looks like everyone's on clipping points. Oh shit, someone just called me. Slap. Slap not here, sorry. I'm drifting. Uh, shit. These guys right beside me. So I'm going to say, yo, tandem. Oh, my God. They all want to tandem. I can't tandem, man. How are you going to tandem someone that can't tandem properly? Hold on. Let's just bring down power a little bit. Maybe that's the culprit of uh, spinning out a little bit easier. So we're going to bring that down. This guy's going to say, yo, I'm flipping shit right now. Let's try to get some tandems with these guys. They hyped. I, I want to be hyped, right? I mean, give me some good tandems, and I'll be hyped. Here we go. Where's my horn? I forget where our horn is. No, nope, that's definitely Horn button? Nope, that's handbrake button. I de Why am I leading? I don't want to lead. Look at everybody. Oh, hell no, man. I don't want to lead. I can't lead. Oh, my God. All right, I'll go right behind these guys. This is perfect. I don't know why I have two maps open. I'm glad I went high. Oh, yeah, I'm real glad. kind of made the corner, though. I'm surprised. How do I get... Oh, shit, wrong button on that one, man. Just want to get rid of... Oh, that's definitely the wrong button. All right, forget it. It's not working. Oh, this is bad. You got a little bit? Yeah, this guy's in a damn Porsche. Like, going against my E30, man. But la oh, yeah, hello. Thank you. I'm okay, don't worry. Guys on my outside, I can't even see him. Come on, we gotta hold something for these guys, man. Look good, look good. I'm trying to just keep it. 
There we go. Thank you. Oh, damn. That guy was right there. I didn't even see him. I'm so sorry, my man. I'm a GT nub. I only come on for the updates. Oh, god damn. Okay. Is this slap or a fake using his name? If you are a huge fan, if not, then stop trying to impersonate YouTubers, man. <laughs> big thank you for watching, my man. Big thank you. He's real. They're probably going to be like, well, how do you know he's real? Someone's going to be like, well, watch his drifting. He's shit. <laughs> oh, this guy just went on the inside of me. Yeah, I can't go full lock on this thing. That's that's not a problem. Unfortunately, it's a little bit harder for me to talk to everybody. I said I was going to get um, a proper keyboard for next time, but it never ended up happening. Yet, anyways. I will have it, man. I will have it. Don't worry. But um, we're just going to try to change a few things here. Hold on. Let's go a little bit less on the rear. Maybe a little bit less on there as well. I'm just trying to just get a little bit more out of here. But I do want to actually give it a little bit more horsepower, though. That's one of the biggest things. Let's go up to three, 358. Let's go 358. Look at that. Easy. I love how PlayStation memorizes things that you say. So I can just be like, hey, man, big thank you. Unfortunately, I mean, like I said, it's just it's harder to actually type on a wheel, right? Have you tried it? If you haven't, give it a shot. You'll know why. That guy's got the new damn Ford out. Oh, that looks nice, too. We're going to have to check that out for another episode for damn sure. Ghost Hog says, me and my friend watch you all the time, man. Big thank you, my dude. Big thank you. Oh, shit. A little bit more horsepower. I don't want to hit this guy. I'm going to hit him. Yep, I'm going to hit him. I'm just steered right into him. I'm bad. Sorry, buddy. I'm bad. Yep. Real money makeup, man. Let me get in these tandems. Is this ludicrous up here? It's just it's gripping up on me. You see that? Ready to get in it. Stay in it. Just like that. Nothing's better than hearing this thing hit red line. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, what the hell was that? Everybody's screwed up, man. Don't follow me, everyone. There we go. And we are gone. Come on, Jake. Catch up, man. Look at that damn McLaren over there. Oh, this is not going to be good. This is not going to be good. This is not going to be good. Oh, I'm so sorry, bro. Oh, my God. Forgot I'm on a lake. I said impressions on the FC guys. Oh my god, yeah. We're going full lock to lock on there. This guy said something in the chat. I'm trying to get to it. Oh, I overcorrected it. Yeah, okay. Steep Rider. What does it say? Oh, it's not going to fanboy in chat. I love your vids. Been here since the beginning, man. That's the host server, man. Big thank you, my man. Oh, the, the server host, man. Sorry. The host server. Oh, shit. Come on, baby. This thing is looking good, though. It's slow as shit, but it looks good. That's all that matters. A step on it, yep. Yeah. I'm coming for this man right there in that damn bumper. Let's go, baby. Oh, he's rattled. Look at him. He's shook. Yep. I think we got this thing dialed in right now. Oh, yep. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. The FC is too good. I can't even drift. I'm so excited, man. But come on, man. Drift it. That's sick, though. I'm actually planning on using all of these cars soon. And obviously, uh, Scuba is a huge track for me. I mean, like I said this many times. Oh, I'm not going to make this. <laughs> I'm going to go right to the same, man. I think I'm on fours a year. My clutch does not work anymore. Why doesn't it work? Maybe because of the fully customizable gears, I'm pretty sure is the issue. So now that I know that, that kind of explains why we keep doing what we're doing and why I can't Watch, kick. okay you know what we're gonna do what we're gonna do we're gonna pull over we're gonna pull over we're gonna exit so we don't cause another goddamn accident and I'm gonna go ahead and put the gears back to normal because that's the only way that you're gonna get to use manual with clutch which is a little bit interesting I don't understand why you can't use a clutch on a fully customizable gearbox but 
I had no clutch that entire time. So let's go back to the state. Oh, that's differential. My bad right there. I gotta redo it, son of a bitch. Okay, let's go 53. And 54, right? Why not, man? Why not? Standard transmission. Let's go back. Back into here. Oh, yep. Enter. I've been entered. Thank you. And let's go in and enter the course. Here we go. Okay. Let's see what we can do here now. Yeah, see? Now I can clutch kick it. Okay. And back to my shitty gears, right? God damn. Man. It's alright though, it's alright. As long as I have a clutch. But, it's so unstable when I try to just clutch it in. Even though we just kind of lined up perfectly right in the corner. But we are going like 16 miles an hour right there. That was terrible. Let's see what happens. There we go, there we go. Oh, we got her! And I got the clutch if necessary, but I don't think so. Oh, yeah, see, don't clutch it. it this game is really weird in the force feedback. Um, as soon as I went to go clutch in as I was handbraking, it just, you know, jerked the car out of there. You don't use the clutch when you're trying to handbrake. You just handbrake. No clutch. It's, it's a really interesting concept, but, uh, yeah. I, I'm not gonna be able to make this, my man. What the hell are we doing right now? I'm gonna spin it. Oh, God. I'm sorry, guys. Cars in neutral. I'm trying to go into second gear right now. Second gear. Thank you. Thank you. Jesus. Oh, spin cycle up there. And he disappeared. Man, it feels like we're in a damn Forza lobby again. Good old times of scuba. This guy just got dummy. This fanatic wheel feels really good. I don't know if I have to update it yet or if it just automatically updated. I don't know if it's a game update, but I'll have to check it out after. So far, though, this car has been treating me very nicely. At least I can save that, at least, right? We have another E30. I'm just trying to get into third gear, but it won't let me. That's great. I don't understand why the short course is not in here. If you guys have any ideas, let me know, please. Maybe it's going to be in a DLC, but I thought for sure it would have been. Oh, boy. Like, as soon as... Why? I don't get it, man. We go into gear. <laughs> I'm so sorry, but I, am. I really am. Like, I'm in first gear. I go into second. But if I go ahead and yank the handbrake and get off the damn... Everyone's waiting for me too, man. I feel so bad when this shit happens. Let's just cruise. Let's just cruise. We just cruising. But sometimes it'll put me out of gear. It just it doesn't make any sense when I yank the handbrake. My bad, slap. No, man. My bad. Because uh, I'm all over the road here. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, baby! Oh, someone's gonna die. I don't like it. Oh! What was that? I am so sorry, everybody. Yep. Okay. So we go around these guys. Yep. Excuse me. Oh, shit! Oh, man. Yep. So there's party up. I can help with tuning. Well, I appreciate that, my man, but... Uh, if you don't know, man, look at me out here. DK! Oh, yep. Yeah. This man's gonna get help too, twice. Much love from DC, man. Big thank you, guys. Shit, man. It's a big lobby out here. Oh, that was a perfect corner. Look at this! And we're looking good, man. It's just, we got so many other people with us right now that's just causing us massive chaos. We're gonna throw this in hard if we can. I was gonna say, if I can over yet. We're sloppy, but I guess we made it, right? Shit, man. Ladies and gentlemen, 
Gran Turismo Sport version 1.15 update. Huge, man. 13 cars, scuba coming in, VR, brand new things to do, Red Bull car. Holy shit, man. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm out of here before I get another lag punch. Oh, my God. You guys can follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, all of which are found down below. Don't forget to hit the bell on the channel, man. A lot of viewers have been following off the channel, and I think it has to do with that bell. Uh, I know YouTube's been implementing some weird policies lately, and I think the bell is the best way to keep locked onto the channel if you guys are missing content, man. That's the biggest thing I can tell you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching once again. Don't forget to slap that like button, like I said, man. Right? I mean, just slap the damn thing, all right? You know, I'll stop asking. But other than that, GT Sport, I'm out.